What's up everyone? Welcome to another episode of Worship Based Tutorials. Today, I'm going to show you three awesome licks that you can incorporate into your playing for the song Hallelujah Here Below by Elevation Worship. Alright, so the first lick I'm going to show you is at around time marker 3 minutes and 30 seconds. We're in the key of D. Uh, the chord of the lick is going to be over is a G chord or the 4 chord. We're in time signature of 3-4 and this lick is going to be all 16th notes. Alright, so basically it's going to start on the low G and then it's going to slide up, the low G on the 3rd fret slide up to the A on the 12th fret, hammer onto the 14th fret of the A string or the B, and then it's going to go to the D on the 10th fret, G on the 12th, D on the 10th, and then G for 4 hits on the 10th fret, then A on the 12th fret to a hammer onto the B, and then you'll land finally on the F sharp on the 14th fret of the E string. Okay, so this is what it sounds like. That's just to break it down. So, one E and a two E and a three E and a one. Again, it's one E and a two E and a three E and a one. Yeah. Okay. So let me play that for you in context. And uh, just to end that, like if you want to play with the rest of them, it's F sharp, 14th fret on the E string, D, 12th fret on the E string, E, open E, and then 2nd fret, F sharp. And it goes back into the groove again. And that's the first lick. Alright, now the second lick, I have the recording starting around time marker, 4 minutes and 50 seconds. Uh, it's going to be over the A chord in the chorus. Uh, it's going to be 30 second notes, so it's going to be quite quick. Um, but since the time signature, or the, sorry, the tempo is so slow, it's not impossible. It's something you can do. I know you can. So let me play it for you slow. Here it is again. Again. Faster. Alright, so here's how that's fingered. Uh, it's going to be uh, fifth fret on the A, two sixteenth notes, and then you're just going to group of 30 second notes, uh, three groups of four 30 second notes in a row. So that's going to be C sharp, ninth fret on the, uh, well sorry, it's going to be a hammer on from the seven to the nine, B to C sharp on the E string, and then seven on the A string to seven on the E string again. Uh, which is your E and your B. That's your first group. Second group is going to be the C sharp again on the ninth fret. Do a hammer on seventh and ninth fret on the A string, E and F sharp. To the seventh fret um, A. It's just an A on the D string. So, so the first two are okay. Then the last one is going to be a hammer on, pull off, slide. Um, from 9 to 11, pull off to 9, slide to 7 on the D string, B, C sharp, B, and A. Then you're landing on B3 on the D over F sharp on your F sharp note, of course, because you're supposed to play that lower note, or the, the bass note there, and it's from the 9th fret on your A string. And then the next measure, B1, starts with a G, so you can do either this G, 10th fret, or you can go lower for a little a little contrast there. Okay, so it sounds like in context. Okay, the last lick will just be, uh, third and last lick will just be a simple lick over the course on the A chord. 
Um, it can put it put it anywhere. I just have it time marked at two minutes and thirty seconds. Going back a little bit, and it's just simply going to be uh, a few sixteenth notes followed by a little hold and um, line the F sharp on D over F sharp on B three. So it sounds like three E and a one E and a two E and a three. E and okay, so it's just over the A chord. That's fifth fret A, seventh fret E on the A string, B ninth fret. From the D string to A, 7th fret. Um, then you're just going to do two hits on the E, 7th fret, on the A string, to F sharp. And the rhythm is... Faster. Just like that. Now in context, it sounds like this. One last bonus lick to teach. Now that's the lick that's actually in the song from the uh, original recording with the bass player. Um, kind of follows the um, vocals as well. And it's at time marker five minutes and 30 seconds. So that la this last lick is gonna be G, third fret, to B, seventh fret, to D, uh, fifth fret, and E, seventh fret, to D, third fret, and the low B string. You need a low B, unfortunately that nice crisp low in terms of the fifth fret and the A's resolution. So it can do some slides. A little grace note slide from five to seven on the E string. And there it is. Let me play that for you in context. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked what you see, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for more content like this, and I'll see you next time.